Hey guys, it's Yash. I hope you all are good. So in this video today, we're going to talk about supplements. How to identify fake and authentic supplements. Now, we Indians are obsessed with supplements. Every day, I'll get at least three messages on my social media, and people will ask me in the college that Yash, konsa supplement lo? Yash, konsa gainer? Konsa whey protein lo? Let me tell you a secret. Supplements don't do a shit. If there's something supplements can offer, it is a very slight edge in your performance and muscle building goals. But there's no supplement in this whole world that will make you jacked up in overnight. But if you consume a fake supplement, chances are that you will get hospitalized overnight. Fake supplements contain adulterated substances from steroids to toxic lead. Unfortunately, 50% of supplements sold in India are fake. I've purchased fake supplement myself and I'll tell you about that in the end. In this video, I'm going to teach you how you can analyze the authenticity of any supplement so that you can always be safe and by genuine. So let's get started. Spelling mistakes. Now this is something I've noticed so many times in fake supplements being sold in the gym. And guys, remember, no supplement company, international or even Indian would ever let that happen. So make sure that there's no typos or spelling mistake on the supplement bag or the tub you're buying. To ensure this, read every single line, every single word on the front and back of the supplement bag. I know there's a lot of things written and it might take some time but it won't be more than 5 or 10 minutes and it is worth it. Nutritional written as neutronial is one of the common mistakes that I have found written over fake supplement bags. Packaging style. Now, supplement companies often keep changing their packaging style time to this is the tub of world's most famous whey protein on of the year 2010. Now this is how it looks in 2016. Now, you can see that the differences in packaging style are clearly visible from naked eyes. So if you're buying a supplement in 2016 that has a packaging style of 2010, chances are either it is expired or it's fake. So do check how the supplement bag or tub looks on the official website of the brand. Now, international companies like On Muscle Tech, Ultimate Nutrition do not sell their products in India directly. They have an official distributor in India. For Ultimate Nutrition, the official distributor is Paradise Nutrition and for Optimum Nutrition, the distributors are HealthCard and New Life. Make sure that there is a stamp of the distributor, official distributor on the supplement bag that you are buying. As you can see that this is the tub of Ultimate Nutrition but apart from brand name and brand logo, there is another stamp of Paradise Nutrition which is its official distributor in India. So I'm putting a link in the description box and you can read about the famous brand and its official distributors in India to make sure that you're always buying authentic products. I've often seen that big reputed supplement stores selling supplements without distributor logo and they say that it's grey import. And tell me one thing guys, you have a supplement store and you choose to do something illegal. So what will you do? Import supplements in grey which is illegal and will cost you more or sell fake supplements which is also illegal but will cost you a hell lot of less money. So I really don't prefer buying supplements without distributor logo and honestly the only branded supplements I use is creatine because no matter which brand you choose they come within the range 5 to 700. Mistakes in the nutritional table. Now this is something I have experienced personally and my first whey protein supplement was a fake expensive shit. Back in the day when I was dumb and I thought that whey protein supplements are some magic tool my gym owner came to me and said that it's time that you take a whey protein. So I asked him that which one I should take and he said that on chalraya, on lele. I googled it and I also found that it had really good reviews. So I collected 5000 in 2 months. I went to the gym. I remember I was extremely happy like a kid going to buy its favorite chocolate. I purchased the tub. I remember I kept it on the seat next to me. I drove it home like a living being. And when I came home, I found that there's some serious errors in the nutritional table. So the protein content was 2 grams high, it was I guess 25 grams whereas the actual protein content in on supplement is 22.5 gram. The fat and carbohydrates were also high and then I compared the tab for the picture on the official website of on and I found some major differences. So remember guys chocolate flavor or any specific flavor of any international brand will always have the same nutritional value in India. Nepal, Bangladesh, US, New Zealand, anywhere. So make sure that the nutritional table of the supplement tab you have purchased matches with the nutritional table present on the official website of the supplement brand. Well, I know some of you might hate me for saying this, but guys, I do not think that buying supplements from your gym trainer or your gym owner is a good idea. It is very clear that owning a gym is a very expensive thing. Treadmills, barbells, weights, and all the machines come at a very high cost. And to recover that cost quickly, 
gym owners sell fake supplements so guys i hope these tips helps you and to buy supplements online i prefer health card vitamin berry and amazon and the stores in delhi that i'm pretty sure sell legit products are new life and rainbow supplements if it have the distributor logo for buying indian supplement brands like my fit fuel or muscle place i suggest you to buy it from their official website somehow if it is available on other websites like paytm or amazon at a very low cost mail the supplement company and they will reply you pretty soon that is it legit or not i did this for my fit fuel when it was available on paytm at a very low cost so guys i hope you know the video do remember supplements are no magic tool keep the focus on your nutrition and lifting heavy so guys take care i'll see you next time with another fitness video peace and guys most important thing it took me one and a half hours to make this video and edit it 20 minutes to write all the content and it will take you just five seconds to bring the caution down there and press the subscribe button so guys do subscribe i'll see you next time with another fitness video do it do it do it do it do it do it and i'm still looking at you